Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Natural Remedies. I'm Tracy. In daily dining, fish is widely recognized as a nutritious food rich in high quality protein, vitamins, and minerals, crucial for maintaining good health. However, certain fish species may carry harmful substances and parasites, which could have adverse effects on human health when consumed over the long term. For the well being of our families, Let's take a look at these fish varieties together. 1. Deep sea fish with high mercury content. Deep sea fish are our best source of DHA, which is beneficial for children's growth and development, especially for their vision and brain cell development. However, some deep sea fish have particularly high mercury content. These toxic substances can be easily absorbed through the gastrointestinal tract and rapidly enter the brain. Prolonged intake can impact brain health, harm the liver and kidneys, and even lead to cancer. Fish with higher mercury content include sharks, swordfish, lush tunas, marlins, red snappers, square tail groupers, skipjack tunas, trivalis, and shellfish, among others. It's advisable to avoid consuming these fish. Instead, opt for deep sea fish with lower mercury content, such as flounders, halibuts, Sauris, Salmon, Haddock, Horse Macros, Dorados, Smaller Tunas and Sardines. 2. African Catfish The African Catfish is incredibly adaptable and can thrive in nearly any water quality. It can even survive in extremely harsh environments like sewers and cesspools, readily consuming household waste and decaying animals. While common catfish is relatively dirty as well, it pales in comparison to the African catfish. It has minimal requirements for water quality and oxygen content, thriving even in foul smelling drains. The African catfish prefers rotten flesh, animal and human excretion, and decaying household garbage, making its body prone to parasites and pathogens. Long term consumption poses significant health risks. If you enjoy eating catfish, consider choosing local native catfish as they tend to be safer options. 3. Some tilapia from China Tilapia is an inexpensive, mild-flavored fish. It is the fourth most commonly consumed type of seafood in the United States. Although farmed all over the world, China is the largest producer of this fish. One report from the United States Food and Drug Administration FDA, revealed that it is common for fish farmed in China to be fed feces from livestock animals. Several reports have revealed highly concerning practices in Chinese tilapia farming, including the use of feces as food and the use of banned chemicals. Although this practice drives down production costs, bacteria like salmonella found in animal waste can contaminate the water and increase the risk of foodborne diseases. Around 73% of the tilapia imported to the United States come from China, where this practice is particularly common. Because of the concerning farming practices involving tilapia in China, it is best to avoid tilapia from China and look for tilapia from other parts of the world. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button if you like my video. Remember to click the bell button too to get notified about my latest videos. Thank you.